Hello, everyone. Sorry about that. I uh, forgot to load up my microphone. Kind of need that to do with these live streams, I've, hold, I've been told. So, where was I? Uh, welcome, once again, to another aptly named Amigo Aaron's Friday Night Disaster Stream. Tonight, we will be delving into the realm of the ZX Spectrum. Once again, a deep dive. Uh, all request ZX Spectrum time. And right out of the gate, uh, I want to get into a game uh, that uh, has been sent to me by a fellow named Alan, uh, who I think was hopefully going to pop into the chat room. I don't know if he's here now. Alan, if you're here, uh, please uh, speak up, uh, because we are going to give uh, his soon-to-be-released game... Oh, yes, there is High Riser uh, in the chat room. Uh, I think I do have it uh, uh, here, uh, Alan. I uh, got the. I think I got the most recent one. So we will. I hope so, anyway. Um, and so what we're gonna do? I thought it'd be fun to give this a whirl uh, live for the first time. Now, uh, Alan has gotten gotten in contact with the boat, and uh, I got wrapped in there, and uh, has been working on this. Now I have not had a chance to play it, but I have had a look at it. Oh wow. Alan's in Central Asia. We will not keep you up too long. I'm glad we jumped on this right away, sir. So let's go ahead and fire it up here. Uh, I am using the Mr. Tonight uh, for the stream. And we're going to look at his game here. Should be a lot of fun. So let's check it out. Asteroids RX. I like it. Now, every everyone loves asteroids. I mean, that's a no-brainer. And so when I see an asteroids game here, I'm ready to rock and roll. So I think I can redefine my keys here so let's redefine them i'm going to use the keyboard for this so let's do uh that that and then we will do uh um let's see for thrust put together that one hyperspace oh man i don't want to use that too much so we'll use h for hyper and for fire i will use uh c and let's see if the allen informs us that if we hit enter we can change the colors Oh, yes! Look at that. Outstanding. All the colors of the spectrum, if you get what I'm saying. <laughs> so clever. So let's kick this off. Let's just go back to the original one here. We're going to hit the button here. If I can remember which button I made the fire button. Gosh, my memory is not good. Well, I guess we'll just redefine those. <laughs> right, left. <laughs> Thrust. Hyper, and uh, we'll make fire F. And here we go. Oh man. Okay. Oh god. Oh no, I've got a st particular strategy that doesn't involve me thrusting all that much. Now I can tell you that the uh, the uh, you know one of the things asteroids had. Oh good god, was. Uh, that crazy kind of gravity, you know, where the, ah, oh, where the, uh, oh, I like that, where the, uh, uh, you know, you kind of had momentum, and this has that. Okay, he's got, oh, great, UFO. I like the fact that the, uh, I like the fact that the, uh, uh, the uh, screen wraps around. Very good. Let me see if I can play this this way. Yeah, here we go. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, good God! Okay, that was... Now you know why I don't thrust too much. Yeah. Now, uh, High Riser, since we've got you in here, my friend, and I think I think this is looking pretty good, uh, have you... Uh, and, and you'll have to forgive me because I've, uh, I'm certainly not an expert in the Spectrum field. Uh, is this the... This is not, I'm guessing, your first uh, venture into the Spectrum. Is this right? Have you, have you done anything anyone in here would have known about? I'd be interested to know uh, your your uh, your uh, portfolio. Let's try this again. Let's see what, how this works. Works perfectly. <laughs> Let's see what. You... Look at that! Oh, oh! All right. Let's try this again. I remember as a kid. Shoot. I remember as a kid. Oh, Jetpack RX. Okay. Okay. I'm going to get in here right up on the keyboard here. 
I'm not going to humiliate myself again. I'm going to do better this time. I remember when I was a kid, though, I used to go to this department store called Murphy's. And Murphy's, early on, they had a little arcade. And this was a game that they had there. And I remember just looking at it and then being stunned. Because this is back when any arcade game could stun you. But that had those beautiful vectors that were just great. And it was just such a neat game. I mean, such a clever game. Oh! I noticed that the little triangle has a, uh, a uh, depression in the back there. It looks quite good. The UFOs are quite good. I'm going to try switching to the green background here in a second just to try it out. Oh, shoot. Let's see if we can... The first game written 100% in assembly. I think you're off from what running, my friend, because I'm guessing that the uh, getting the physics down in this was probably no easy task. Now, I'm not a programmer. I know some of you may be stunned. Oh, yeah. Get out of there. Now, is this going to be a, a commercial product, uh, High Riser, or is this going to be uh, uh, something that is uh, a, a shareware? Are you going to uh, take donations on this? Anything like that? Uh, I'm sure people would be interested in knowing, or or if they know where to purchase said game, uh, what do you or do you have that? Not I mean, if you don't have that yet, you don't have to you know you don't have to go into it if you don't have that information ready. But and also how I mean this seems it seems pretty ready to go to me. How close are you? How close is this to release? If I if I can ask you, I'd be interested in knowing that as well. After this, remind me I'm we're going to switch the colors and see what it looks like. Outstanding. Also, the, the the way the asteroids break. Again, this stuff all seems like it would be... You know, I'm a, a neophyte, but it seems like it would be difficult to, to pull off. Uh, go! Oh, good God! That was too much at once. I can do it. I can do it. Come on. Would you just die? There it is. Whoops! Okay. Just for those that aren't reading, uh, Alan says you can. Uh, all his games are free on pay. Uh, free. Uh, for those who support him on Patreon. Otherwise, it's a couple bucks. That seems like a, a totally good way to do it, man. Uh, can you, if you would like, uh, Alan? To share your Patreon information there, I'd wager you may have some takers. Uh, because uh, I think you got a winner here. I'm going to change the colors here. I can turn the audio up, absolutely. I'll do that right now. I'm using my new capture card. So, yes, yeah, some of the, uh, some of the uh, adjustments might need to be made. All right, and he has posted his Patreon there. Uh, so, if you are interested... Uh, in what Alan's got cooking over there. Tell me if that helps, fellas. It's definitely louder on my end. I think I kind of like the green! I kind of like the green here. I couldn't hear those explosions of the asteroids before either, so that definitely makes a difference. Hey... I'd be interested in knowing, uh, Alan. I've got a question. Uh, I am playing this on the Mister. It's working perfectly. Um, how long? How long did this take you to put together? Uh, if I may ask, like, what's it take? What's it take to put a game like this together? You said this is the first game you've did a hundred percent. So, what's 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 the uh, what's the time? What's the time uh, from starting to completion? I mean, clearly the game design was pretty much done. It, you had to just basically program it and figure out how you're going to lay it out. What's that? How long does that take? Yeah, Hitch, the uh, programmer of this is in the chat. Hi, Riser. Also, this was a so a pretty quick turnaround then, eh? Now, do you program on any other systems, or is this is the, is the Spectrum your baby? You know, hyperspace, don't you always get brutally murdered when you use that, Pixels? 
That's why I never use it. <laughs> See, that's Hitch gets it. You know, I gotta tell you, uh, Alan, aka High Roger, I think I think this I mean, I don't know what you've got left, and I know programmers know more than I do, but I mean, it seems like it's good to go. Like I'm not having any trouble uh with it. I mean, I don't I haven't seen anything that was that was uh loose. Oh, okay, very good. Good temp. Let's try a different color here. Let's go with let's try the yellow. I like it bright. There it is. Let's try that. Let's go for a couple more here. I love. I'm. I'm. I will say. I'm. I'm an asteroids mark. Uh, big time. I know it's hard to tell. It's funny because I'm playing this with the keyboard. And I thought I don't. Alan, does this have? Does this have gamepad support or does this have Kempton uh, joysticks? Where I didn't even look. Shoot. I'm. I used to always used to play this. Uh, Hey, Poe! What's going on? The boys from Texas. Hey, we've got a uh, brand new game upcoming get release here uh, from our buddy who's in the chat here, uh, Texas guys. A uh, high riser. This is a this is just coming out into release. Uh, so if you are if you're like asteroids, I think this is your Huckleberry here. Let's see here. Anyway, uh, Kempton is coded but not implemented. So that so. That will be in the final release, then, Alan. When you, I assume, when you get this thing ready, ready for prime time. Let's try. I don't like blue. Let's try red. That seems gaudy. Oh shoot! Why did I do that? Let's just. Uh, there we go. Let's try that again here. Uh, Hitch, if you're interested. Uh, uh, he gave his Patreon information up there. Uh, if you're one of his Patreon members, you can get this for nothing, or you can throw him a couple bucks. Either way. Does the RX stand for something, and I'm an idiot? What does that mean, exactly? Someone help a brother out here, because I don't know. I hope this is coming out okay on the stream. I mean, it looks real sharp. Real high quality. I mean, you. Can, I mean, listen. This is the kind of game that the that the Spectrum was born to play. Like basically transparent <laughs> vector type graphics. But I mean, it it does it well. You'll notice the speed is nice. And uh, oh, shoot! I love that. That even the ship going apart it's, it's real well done. Hyperspace. That was for you, Pixels, my friend. Redux and Remix. Oh, okay. I must not have gotten that one out yet. That's cool, though. Very good. Outstanding. Well, listen. Uh, I want to thank uh, Alan, a.k.a. High Riser, for uh, sending this over for us to look at. Listen, we really appreciate it, my friend. I think you got a winner. Uh, again, if uh, anyone's interested in uh, uh, supporting... Uh, High Riser, he has uh, stuck his uh, his uh, Patreon information up in the uh, up in the chat there, and you can hop back and have a look at it. Uh, but uh, if you're in asteroids on the spectrum, hey, a couple bucks, you're in. I like it. And now I've got to try to find your the uh, what was it, the Jetpack RX, because that sounds cool too. I like I, I like Jetpack. It's a fun game. Great stuff, uh, High Riser. Uh, we appreciate it, man. Uh, and uh, there you go. That was Asteroids RX. Oh, you have about five games. I wonder if I've got any here. I've been here on the hard drive. Are they all Spectrum games? Let me see what I've got here. Um, uh, okay. Oh, beautiful, man. Well, I'll, the next time I do Spectrum, I'm gonna go grab all those and we'll have a look at the whole belly lot of them. I love it. Um, while we're while we're transitioning here, uh, I am. This is an all request. This is all request ZX Spectrum. If anyone here uh, would like uh, a particular Spectrum game, you guys know you guys know better than I do uh, what the good stuff is. So uh, drop a couple hints my way, 
and I will uh I'll give it a shot. Okay, man, what do you got, Riser? Just notice my chat for whatever reason is a little bit off up here. Let me fix that while we're waiting here. Can't ever make him perfect. Let's see what we can do here. Oh! <laughs> well, you do know what I like. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Well, when you get a chance, I've got a. I can't add this stuff on the fly because I've got a hard drive image. So if you've got that, because I definitely would like to have a look at it, if you can email it over to me, I will check it out and I'll, we'll play it on the next go around. It's a problem with this stupid thing. I do love Benny Hill. It's true. It's absolutely true. Beautiful. Thank you, my friend. Well, I I saw that the uh, the uh, the Hitchter has recommended. It's funny. One of the first games I ever played on the Spectrum. Uh, 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 and death ray, death chase, uh, and this is a great, it's a great game. So I'm gonna give that one a whirl. I'm sure I've got that one on here. Let me have a quick look. Uh, thanks again, Alan. That was awesome, man. I really enjoyed that. So we're gonna have a look at death chase. It's funny. Me and my brother played this on another. On what was it? We played this on. Uh, we we actually there's another version. Oh, it was on the Cocos where we played it, and it was pretty good there too. Actually, there we go. Death Chase, bam, easy as pie. And so, let's give this a whirl. Uh, we will go with the Kempston here, and we'll pray that it works. There we go. Listen. That's the kind of noise that only a Spectrum can make. Oh! Oh, I knew I wasn't going to make that. That gummit. My microphone cord got it way in my joystick cord. I'm blaming that. Die. I thought it was a good port, though, Curtis, in all honesty. I thought it was a real good... I thought they did a good job, man. Yeah. Night Patrol. A great movie, by the way. No, Ricky, this is Death Chase. I, I picked this game uh, for one of the early... Uh, I, wonder if it was, I, I think this was... A, I can't believe it's an ARG or an R. Sinclair, but I, I, this is one of the games I picked solely on the basis of the coolness of the name. So it was a good choice. It's way better than that Return of the Jedi, by the way. I can tell you that right now. This is one where we should try we should try cranking up the speed. That might be kind of fun. <laughs> like double the speed. We'll see how this thing runs. That might be a good time. And this is all about just not hitting these trees. Here comes the tank. In a generous rank. Oh, oh god! Now how could you get through that? That was a freaking wall of trees, man. Thank you, boat. Boat, did you see any of that Asteroids RX? Were you one for that? All right, hold on a second. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna up the speed just for fun. Let's see what happens when you up the speed on this thing. We're gonna double it. Double the speed here. See what that's like. I know, Hitch. Listen, I'm, I'm I'm working my way back into it, man. If it will load, it may not load at double the speed. It wouldn't even load there. That's kind of surprising because nothing ever does it load on this. Very unusual. Maybe some stuff. Of course, to be honest, I don't. It's not like I often try to load stuff at double the speed. So in retrospect, 
All right. Oh, De La Morte. Holy crap, dude. Where are you landing all that stuff at, man? Good grief. Uh, if you didn't spend much money on that, I'd say you did pretty good. Even if you did spend a lot, that's a lot of stuff. Would you come here? Oh, God! How is this guy baiting me? There he goes. There you go. Available now. A little high. They had me turn it up for the last game. It's a... Here, I turned it down there a little bit for you guys. Sorry. What, that grating engine noise doesn't do it for you both? Having a better, I'm having a better game of it there, Hitch. You were killing me. Killing me. I'm not the player you are, my friend. I'm a ham and egger. I admit that. Where'd that sucker go? Oh, God! Now, how can you get past that? There's no way. Oh, yeah, Del Morte. No kidding, pal. You hit the, You went to the pay window, my friend. I'm telling you, sometimes these trees. I remember when I when we were, I was getting into this real hot and heavy. That going slower was actually not the worst idea. I'm not doing it now, clearly. But I remember thinking to myself, man, if you go real slow, you're in good shape. Come here. Would you? Would you die? Rhymony. Night Patrol, here we go. Does anybody in the chat here, and this is going to kind of give away your age, but did anyone buy this when it was originally on the market? Anybody remember going in their local newsstand or whatever and plunking down two ninety nine dollars to uh, pick this tape up? And then, if you did buy it, what was your what were your initial thoughts? I mean, this is I think this is one of your better, uh, Earl. You know, I think it's a pretty sweet game. But did did you like it when you bought it? I'd be interested to know if you, if it was something when you got home you were happy with it. Come on, Hitch, you bought this when it was originally out. Is that what you're trying to tell me? A bold statement about about your taste and your age. I got this one. I got this one. No! Zoom! That irritates me. I'm not going to lie to you. All right. So. Death Chase. A great game. Whether I've got the chops for it, that's another story altogether. What would we go with next? Who would like to... You've got all the specky colors in the rainbow here. What would you like to see on the specky? And if you've suggested something in the past few minutes while I was playing, please re-suggest it, uh, and I will I will give it a whirl. So I'm up for any kind of action. If you got if you've got a uh, if you've got something you'd like to say uh, to see, I will play it. Full. Let's see what we got here. Holy smokes. Okay, we got a bunch of stuff here. Holy, Bard's Tale. What are you trying to do to me? <laughs> Turrican, Trantor, and Full Throttle. Okay. And if. Listen, we would try that. Okay, so let's do it. Let's give these a shot. I'm ready for any kind of action. And Wild Bunch. We'll do all those. You know, normally I can't get anyone to give me anything, and you guys are. Taking care of business here. I love it. So first on the docket. How old are you? How old are you, Hitch? You are you you surely are you older than me? Because that would be just the best. If you were. I'm not gonna lie. I would make me a head make my night. 
All right, so the first on the docket is the specky version of Turrican, which I, I'm trying to remember if I've played this or not, or if I knew it even had this. So we're going to find out. I'll know when I play it. As you all know, that I'm I'm horrible at Turrican on any system. Oh, man, they even get Turrican 2. Like, in fact, I don't see Turrican 1, so it looks like we're playing Turrican 2. Let's see if it works. Let's go with that. Cross your fingers. Uh, stop tape. Got it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah! It's exactly like the Amiga. I hope that picked up my joystick. Start tape. All right, here we go. Okay. Stop tape. Oh, it didn't pick up my joystick. Okay. Let me find out what the keys are here. Maybe I have to switch the sticks. Let me see if that's what it is. Sometimes that'll happen. Although not normal on the spectrum. Well, let me see if I can find out what the keys are on this thing. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Let me get back there. I'll just I'll just hit the I'll hit the Kimson quicker this time. It's probably the easiest way to do it. Oh, Ricky, you're killing it. Why? Why did you kill it? Is it that bad? I thought it was. It looked pretty good to me. Let's try it again. This time I'll get the kid. You guys, you guys are tough. You're too tough. Oh, boat, boat. Don't do, don't do your dance. Don't do your burial dance, boat. There we go. Now we got it. Kemp's it away. Yeah. Let's see if this works this time. Look, they kept that. That's pretty cool. Stop tape. All right, we're off. Now, can I swing my gimmick around? Oh, yeah! What do you think of that boat, John Boat of Car? Mr. Burial? They kept that. Wow. This is acid tripomania running wild here. Let's see if they've. Wasn't there a place where you could get a ton of power? It's real easy. Is this it? Okay. Is it the easiest thing to control? I'm not gonna lie. No. <laughs> it's not. It's absolutely not. And also, this guy didn't jump too good. <laughs> Holy cow! <laughs> He's a little rough. <laughs> it's a little rough. Come on. Can I... Can I... Oh, here we go. Yes! This is what I meant. Up here. No, it's not what I meant. Alright. It's sort of in monochrome, man. There we go. All right. I just need a better gun. Hey, I'm, I'm surviving not that long. Rats. You know, when you think of Turrican 2, the one thing I think of is the blissful silence. No tunes. No great music, that's for sure. Just nothing but quiet. That's what made this game popular. Oh, wait, no. It was the incredible soundtrack. <laughs> Which, unfortunately, this does not have. Because that really goes a long way. You know, the jumping in this... He can jump higher than I anticipated. He's just ultra, ultra floaty. That's what it was. Because I couldn't figure out, I was like, why can't I get to anything? Because he was, I wasn't holding jump long enough. Did I get killed? It doesn't even tell you when you die, you're just gone. 
No, there's no music in this one, man. And I'm playing this in 128 mode. This is the, this is the only version I had. So, did anyone? I'm guessing. Hey, I guess you. I bet you didn't buy this one, did you, Hitch? Something tells me this wasn't on the docket back in the day. You know, I will say. I have never seen an, a, a, a larger ad for upgrading your Spectrum to an Amiga than this game. This right here. If you thought to yourself, you know, the Specky might make it to the next generation. Nah. This right here takes it, takes it to the house. If you compare this to the Amiga version, it is night and day. God, this is hard, too. Oh, man. You sound like Boat Hitch. It is strange that they had that uh, nice... Uh, who knows? This maybe this takes a lot of processing power, what they got going on here. It's not easy to put this many trippy colors on the screen at once. Whoa. What's happening? Okay, I guess I can't go that way. Back into the cave. Listen, I'm a man of my word. I'm going to play all my men here. We're going in. Yes. I made it, though. I like the little straw. Oh, God. How did you see that? Mm. That's a beatdown. That's a dragon-style beatdown. I can never get past that guy on the Amiga version. I'm doing great. This is my new favorite version. Except for that. Uh-oh. Jump. Do you know? Wrong way, dummy. This guy barely. This is. Remember when you, you ever see those old Marvel cartoons or Hanna Barbera? They would barely animate them. It's like they would give you. They would give the bad guy. They'd give the guys like four frames of animation. And this is what this reminds me of. It's like a. It's almost like Paper Mario. It's just like a paper cut out of a guy. He's jumping around. Look at him. Come on. No. Yeah, even Boat can't bury the music. It is very Huckleberry Hound-like, Boat. <laughs> You're right. Ah! Oh! <laughs> you, you nailed it. Huckleberry Hound. You got it right. That's exactly what it is, man. <laughs> I can't but laugh. All right, so that was Turrican. An excellent choice. Thank you for that. Uh, hey, I'm glad you picked that because it's neat to see what that looked like. I, you know, that's pretty cool. I don't think I had played that. Let's move on to the next request. Now, listen, we're not going to sit here and do this that much, but we're, I promise we're going to look at it because my good friend, my bosom companion, my twin brother of different mother, Ricky DeRocher, demands that we at least take a brief glimpse at Bard's Tale. I believe he may have suggested this in the past. I'm not 100% sure. But let's look at it. For those of you that haven't seen that on here, if it does in fact exist, then it does. And here we go. The the original Bard's Tale. Anybody here a big Bard's Tale guy? Yeah. <laughs> Very good. Don't Now, please don't encourage him, Curtis. This is the Bard's Tale. Uh, let's just see if we can... I wonder if we can load a party. I'm afraid he would touch that. So let's... Let's just see what happens though. What the heck? What do we got to do here? Uh, let's see. Load party. We don't have a party to load. So we'll just... Let's see here. Oh, the raw... Okay, so we can just exit the guild then. There we go. Now, I'm sure this doesn't use the Kempston. This is quite a bit different. Yeah, no kid, Rick. So, this is your old, the old-fashioned Bard's Tale. I've got to sit here and try to figure out the controls for the Bard's Tale. So, if I'm pause, face east. I don't know how I did that. Okay, so Z is east. Or it tells you something. Cast a spell. Play a tune. Hey, Boat, there you go. What? We may not be playing this very long at all, uh, my friend. No, no. Uh-oh. Well, at least we're going to have a battle here. Party attack. Uh, let's get Brian the Fist. In the... <laughs> Brian the Fist? El Cid. Uh, party attack. Oh, wait. Am I attacking my own party? 
I may be. Samson. Well, we'll find out what happens. Hide in shadows. That sounds cool. Cast spell. Uh, fireball. You know, that's about how long I've been since I played this. I don't remember anything. Let's see. Uh, party attack. Omar, party attack. Let's see what happens. Yes. Ha! Ah, ah, yep. I'm beating the heck out of my own party. That's what I thought was going on. <laughs> Good night, Mitts. <laughs> I can't imagine that the bard's tail ran you off, Mitts. Come on. <laughs> We're beating the hell out of Brian the Fist, though. I'll tell you that right now. That's what he gets for beating this party. So there you go, Ricky DeRocher. Smarty pants. Just to, I will say, just to, annoy, just to abuse Boat, I was more than happy to do it. All right, let me see what we had next. We had a lot of these. So the next one I saw here was from Pixels of Dawn. Trantor, the last Stormtrooper. That doesn't sound real. No one's buying that, are they? Trantor? I can't. Okay. Let's try Trantor. Let's try Trantor. <laughs> you can't. Listen, remind me ever to play a D&D in your party, Ricky. Let's try Trantor. Trantor, the last Stormtrooper. Not a bad thing, really. Let's see if I've got that game. It sounds so good. This doesn't sound even real. Okay, let's see here. Trantor. If you did make that up, Pixels, please tell me. Don't make me go through this rigmarole. Tra... I'll be darned. That's a real game, ladies and gentlemen. That is a real... <laughs> I would have bet a million dollars that that was a baloney game. I'm not going to lie. There's no way that was real. I couldn't believe it. But by God, it is. It is Trantor, the last Doctor. But look at this cutscene. Look at that ship. They got a direct TV dish on there. Look at that. That's the bomb. I love that. Look at. Oh, here, is this the last stormtrooper? Oh no. That's not a good start for him. Okay. Look at that. Oh, that's very impressive, Pixel. Oh! Listen to that! Yeah! I love that. That's great, y'all. Joystick. Let's play Trantor. Great opening. Whoa! Holy cow, look at this! Look at Trantor! He looks awesome! Man, this is... This is some high-end graphics here. Boat, put this on the list. What am I supposed to do in this game, Pix? I just not die? Check out my gun. That's awesome. Boat, did you think that was a real game? <laughs> Get over that. Oh, no. Turn around, Trantor. You idiot. No, Trantor. This, like, this reminds me of... The, it sounds like one of those, ga those uh, old movies you'd pick up in the 80s. You know? Hawk the Slayer type thing. Oh, Trantor's down. Yeah, no kidding. All right, we gotta try that again. Oh, oh, sp Gabe's Gabe's giving me the business. That's not cool. Let's try that again. Vin Vingador. Toxico. Now that is a hell of a name 
and I bet my bottom dollar that you're a luchador. Because if that's not a luchador name, I've never heard one. Vintage Vingador Toxico. You win the game. You win the name game, pal. I know I haven't seen you around before because I don't remember that name. Vinge. Yeah, man. Now, be honest with me, uh, uh, Vingador. That is not your real name, right? You don't. That's not your walking around name. And if it's not, it should be. I would love to hear that name announced at the PTA meeting. You know, this is. <laughs> can we have Johnny's parents come up on stage? Vingador Toxico. Oh crap! Okay, I gotta pay attention here. The name distracted me. Woo. This is, I mean, these are some of the best graphics I've seen on this machine. Oh, no, I'm out of bullets? What's going on? Oh, Vin... <laughs> Gluff? Is Gluff a game? <laughs> Gluff? Does that stand for something? Oh, listen, it's way... I hate those movies, no offense. I can't stand the Toxic Avenger movies uh, from from uh trauma but your name is awesome so listen you have you pulled something out of that series that i can't stand i'll give you credit and sadly i've seen a bunch of those toxic avengers films but back in the day i used to watch them let's try this gloof okay it's on the list man if i've got it we're gonna try it whoa we're gonna go this way this time see how we do how am i doing so far <laughs> i can't get over the smoothness of this guy is that an elevator going down? It is! Oh, God! What happened? Oh, I think I reset the timer. Something. I will say, these guys are positioned to be very difficult to deal with. What's that guy doing? Oh, what a jerk. Oh, here we go. Not this crap. Look at the way he jumps. He jumps like he's a hurdler. Clearly, the last stormtrooper was also a, quite an athlete. God. Go! Dead coming. Oh, look at this! Did you see that? I made it! Oh, God! Oh, no! I, I, I don't want to be there! Oh, I'm taking a beat in here. I think your beam's got to, like, recharge to a certain degree. That's why I couldn't use it sometimes. Like right now, for example. Oh, uh, listen. Who suggested this? You get a cookie. Thumbs way up for Trantor. Oh, it's Pixels of Dawn. Pixels of Dawn. Pixels, you are uh, a star, my friend. That was a that was a good a good selection there. Okay, next on the docket... Thuris, uh, Thuris Bard, our good friend, wants to see Full Throttle. I don't remember playing that one either, so I'm looking forward to it. Full Throttle. You guys are picking out some interesting stuff tonight. Let's see what we got here. Full Throttle it is. Let's get over to it. Oops. Let's see if I've got it here. Full throttle. I got it. All right, man. Just hit the button here. And we're off. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's see. We don't want keyboard. Okay, here we go. What we got here? Change track. Hey, are these real tracks? Anybody know? Donington, is that real? Is that a real, is that a real one? It's always interesting to know. Okay. Ah, it's not that. It's not that full throttle, Tex. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, let's see what the tracks are. Oh, look at this, y'all. Okay. Um, space to select. Let's see. Oh, I see. Okay. Let's pick Silverstone. That one looks pretty easy. Let's do that one. And hit enter. And then we've already got the Kempston. Let's see here. I think we're good to go. So let's start racing. Okay. All 
Oh, yeah. Look how smooth, though. Not bad. Not sure what the, the button does. Maybe nothing. Oh, my God! And this sucker's... It's smooth. I like it. I mean, they did a good job on the actual track. All right. Uh, yeah, I've got to find another bike first. Third part. <laughs> What's the button do, dude? Do you know? Is it do anything? Hey, yes, I see a biker up there. Here we go. Man. This is one of those games you don't want to go full throttle, despite the name. Oh, that you weren't kidding. That's cold. Okay. Hey, Thurist Bard, having played this game before, how would you rate my performance? Would you go with great or superior? Oh! Oh no! No, I was doing well. Go! No, no! Now, see, that's not realistic. Boat, you and Hitch to start a show and just call it Retro Haters. You guys just kill everything. Hey, I passed some guys. Huzzah! I mean, that's a good name, too. You can use that, man. I'm going to give that to y'all. Just uh, just don't hate on me. It's like kicking a corpse doing that. Oh! oh. How come it makes a happy noise when you hit someone? That's the thing I can't figure out. Oh! Get over there! This track looks so much easier when I looked at it on the thing. How many laps are we doing? Anybody know? I'm assuming it's the last lap. Oh, nope. Go hit him! No! 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 Would you go? Hey, Thurs Bard, is this one that you owned back in the day? I, I always gotta ask that because I always think it's neat. I like the uh, since of course we have no reference for that over here, so that's one thing we never got to do over here. We didn't get to go to like the grocery store or the newsstand and just pick up games. That's not the way it, it never worked that way here ever. The best we could do is go to the newsstand and pick up like an Amiga format or something that had a disc on it. That was always that's really about the only way I could get Amiga stuff was just picking up those cover discs because you couldn't buy it anywhere, despite what Tin Mark tells you. All right. I think that was I think that wasn't bad. That game had some good elements and some bad elements. The good elements, the track. I will say I like the track in it. So there you go, full full throttle. All right, there you go, full throttle. Let's see what was next on the docket here. That was fun. So next on the docket, we've got. Let's see here. Hit your 53. I just saw that. Congratulations, my friend. You are the king dong of age tonight. Even I'm not that old. Okay. Trantor, full throttle. R-Typer, and then Wild Bunch, and then Crisis. Everybody remember that. R-Type, Wild Bunch, Crisis. That's what we're going to play. So let me get that going here. R-Type. This one we've had a cup of coffee with back in the day. Let's go down here to R Typer. That was easy to download, easy to load up. Now, bam, man, you've got to love this. You've got to love this core. I mean, it's so good. Yeah, didn't we do this on the showboat? I believe. All right, R Type has been programmed. We don't care about any of that. Let's go. Game time, yo. I guess we got to sit through this for a second. May, oh, you mail-ordered a lot of your stuff, eh? Very good. 
This was on tape, so this might take a second here. There we go. All right. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Look at that. Fancy. Let's see here. Press fire to play. Oh, all right. Yeah. Here we go. I thought it supported stick. Remember that more T Vicar game we played, Boat? What a strange name. You know, our type was around in the States. You know, I don't think games shoot I don't think shoot 'em ups were as big a deal in the States. I mean they were around, but like I don't remember any like I remember the Raiden series being pretty popular. You know, but I don't remember any, like, Ultra... I mean, stuff like Galaga was popular, but I don't remember stuff like R-Type or some Salamander and that crap. I don't remember anybody giving a crap about that stuff. I'll be honest with you. Yes, Gulf. I'll get that one, too. Or Gluff. Sorry, my bad. Now, in the old, old arcade days, shooters got a lot more attention. Your Galagas, your Galaxians, your Gorfs. A lot of Gs back then, too. Your Time Pilots. Your Gyruses. Another G. The one that stood out to me was, like I said, whenever they, when they released... When they released, uh... When they released Raiden. I remember thinking Raiden was a pretty big deal. Thank you, Pix. The problem is I can't integrate those on the fly because I'm using a hard drive, so. I'm sure some people have a better setup than me on the Mister, but I'm using a virtual hard drive, so I can't actually just add stuff, which is a pain. Oh, yeah, thanks, dude. It's funny, I downloaded this thing today off of uh, archive.org. I was getting ready for the show, and I was like, I'm going to get the latest and greatest games. Because I figured since we're trying Alan's new game, that maybe we could try some other new stuff. Well, and I got one, but I couldn't, for whatever reason, I couldn't make my own virtual drive. It just didn't work, so no big deal. It's not like I don't have enough stuff to play. But All right, I need to get that power up so I can get some action here. You may have noticed that I'm not the King Dong of these sorts of games either. This is not bad, though. Not bad at all. I mean, it play it, it controls real good. It controls quite nicely. I'm not letting this guy screw me again. I'll learn my lesson. Yeah. All right, not bad. Yeah, it does. It absolutely. Oh, don't. Mm, that sucked. That sucked. I was right there with my power ball. Yeah, it's one of those games. If you hold it long, you hold it down. You know that stick. Funny thing is, most stuff only takes one shot, as far as I've gotten. So, sh what are you gonna do there? The bullet was going right down the road. Dead gum. There you go. R type. All right. Now, who does anyone remember the things I told you to remember? Uh, I can't. What was the next game? Who can remember? Was it Wild Bunch? Wild Bunch. That was the next game. Thank you. Hey, I remembered picks. Hey, everybody remembered. Good job, guys. You know me all too well. Let's load up the wild bunch here. All right. I'm pleasantly surprised that I've had the majority of these games here. Wild bunch. We got it. 
All right. Ooh. Okay. Firebird. I like their. Okay. Better go with difficulty one. Ooh, that's a nice sound. Yeah, that Mario Golf might be fun. I love golf. Oh. What is this? Walking home one night when you hear a gunshot. Also, this is actually about the wild butt. Okay, there's your setup right there. I got hosed. Okay. I was... Yeah, that's a real good one in a boat. There we go. Um, Man, you know where you don't want to live? Nugget City. Although Bulletville doesn't sound too appealing either. But listen, if you're going to be... If you're in the World West, please visit Nugget City. Let's go there. Oh, so this is one of these type games, eh? It sounds like an Atari's booting up. <laughs> what the hell is that? Let's see. Um, listen, when the first thing you do when you go to a city, go to the saloon. Sacktown. I can't go back to Sacktown. Let's see. What do you want to do in the dra Hey, listen. What would Boat of Car do in that saloon? Let me tell you what he'll do. He'd do number one. Um... What do you think, Boat? You're not a bit. You love beer. Let's go with the. We better. I don't. I don't know if Boat would start off with the, with the red eye. Let's just go with the. Whoa! I don't know what that means. Okay, and the. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, listen. Here's what you do when that happens. Just type run. You're in. And then yeah, yeah. That's what happens, man. So. List. Oh. Man, the wild bunch is not what I expected. Uh. Help. Okay. Wild bunch. We'll have to come back to that one sometime in the near future. <laughs> Holy smokes. Try to get a 48 mode. Okay. Hi, Roger. Still with us. Thank you, my friend. We will do that. I'll let you guys beside, behind the scenes here as I do it. Wild bunch. Oh. It didn't give me the option. Let's try to try to get home a second here. Let's see here. Um. You stayed up for the wild bunch? Oh my god. Let's try this one more time. I'm not going to touch the joystick here. Let's try it again. Now, have you guys actually played this? So, like, Alan, is this a game you're, like, are, you, you're down with? Those are being much more receptive now. Could be a little memory thing or something there. Okay. No, I don't think so, Foos. Put it on the list, pal. All right, we're not going back to Nugget City. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna play in Nugget City. We're gonna go to Bulletville. Sounds safe. All right, there's the familiar sound we all love. Now listen, if you guys are experts at this. Please hold my hand and and bring me along. I'd be more than happy to follow your uh, your uh, advice. Let's go to ha ha ha. Listen, don't let the Texas boys hear you say that they might shoot you. Let's go to the sheriff's office. Wait a minute. I think I've seen that guy. 
Look at that. Anybody recognize that? <laughs> All right. Tex, the tall Texan. All right. Let's see here. Let's go to the tele. Let's go to the uh, the store. Um, I got fifty bucks. Well, first things first. We just we... one for the road. You know what I'm saying? All right. Now that we've got our whiskey, um, we can't buy a horse. Look at that. Rifles. A knife. Let's get a knife. Yeah. Hey, look at that, Dave. Just like I got it. Um, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Great coat. I hope it's one of those spaghetti western coats like Clint Eastwood used to wear. Man, it's, I guess I'm, already, I'm wearing a coat, I guess. It wouldn't let me have that. Uh, let's get a blanket. Take that. Just one. And then, um, food. Man, you've got to buy horse food? Get the horse graze? Let's buy uh, five of those. Um, and then, oh, canteen of water. Got to have that. We're in the desert. Get five of those, too. Got five canteens. That's what you need. Oh my gosh, yeah, but I don't want to cheat, High Riser, because look, we already crashed this sucker once. How often is the snake going to bite you? Uh, well, I take a chance. That's my motto. Okay, food, canteen, coat, whiskey, blanket. You know, I hate to get caught in an emergency without having an extra whiskey. So let's get one more. Now we're ready. Okay, O to leave. Oh, zero, I guess is what it means to say. Okay. Uh, let's go to the telegraph office. 20 bucks? Hell no. Is there no dignity? You don't show that stuff. Oh, let's play poker. Let's try that. I wonder if we get that. Oh, look, we get to play. Okay. Well, sort of. Look at that. I right out of the gate, I got a flush. Yes. Okay. I got a pair of kings and a pair of nines. That dumb shit. I want to raise. I want to raise. Yes. Let's see here. How much money do I got? Let's bet $10. That's like a million dollars back in the day. Oh, did I not raise him? Let's see. Five. All right. Oh, smart ass. Okay. What? No. What? Are you kidding me? I didn't realize I was that broke. Dad gum it. Okay, I'm I'm getting out of this crap town. Move on. This place is a dump. Alright, let's try. I hear good things are happening in Dodge City. Let's see. Start my job. We gotta get there. Okay. Okay, I can see why you like this. Uh, I mean, there is a certain appeal to this. I'm not gonna lie. A mad, angry buffalo. Man, he's mad and angry. Can you bribe a buffalo? I don't have any money. Well, I'd love to try that, though. Um, Let's try... Boy. What do you guys think? Should we fight him or should we run? I, I got screwed. I got screwed. Bri I, but I don't have any money. Oh, what the hell. I got four bucks. I'm going to give the buffalo two dollars. Uh, <laughs> they've got a valid point there. Let's run. 
Okay, fine. We gotta fight him. I've got to knock him out. Fight. How much strength will I use? A hundred. The buffalo's annoyed. <laughs> so now it's a mad, angry, annoyed buffalo. We're taking this sucker down. I'm going to annoy him with 200 points of strength. That's the end of that bull, or buffalo. Can we eat him or something? Are you kidding me? Desperados? Now, you know desperados you can bribe. Because I'm a desperado. I'm going to bribe one dollar. Oh, okay. That may have insulted him. Okay. Now, wait a minute. Hear me out, guys. Two dollar. All right, you suckers. I'm going to use 50. Because if I can kill a buffalo... Yeah, that's what I thought. Man, there's a lot of... Oh, another Desperado? I'm just going to annihilate this sucker. Goodbye. Get out. Oh! Punk. What? No, not my blanket! Oh, great. God, how long does it take to get to Dodge City? I knew I should have looked at that damn map. Vicious Desperado, another one. Okay, I'm gonna kill this guy. 100 strength. Yes. Can I take his blanket? Yeah, I did! Yes! I did take it! That's what you get. It's probably that same guy. A big, desperate red Indian. <sighs> Listen. Haven't these people suffered enough? Let's, let's give them a few bucks. Come on, now. Here's three dollars. No! <sighs> of all the... What is this? What is this? Why is this guy bugging me? Both, this game's really old. You can't blame the game. All right. I'm going to kill this guy. I hate to do it. Can I have my gun back? Gun? Another one? A trapper? Fight. How hard can it be to kill a trapper? Well, pretty hard. Apparently. Okay. Can I get some traps or some skins? But I bought a bunch of food. Do you have to eat? I didn't know it was this far. Alan, I didn't know. Seven days? I didn't know. Okay. Plus, every time you turn around, there's a big angry something taking you, taking you on. I'm getting angry and annoyed. Oh. Okay. We've got to be in Dodge City today. Oh, no. No! Oh. This is looking dire. Dire. How did you know that? Did it say that, Curtis? Did I not see? Take off Thurs Bard, you hoser. I, did, I, I didn't know. Oh, it did? Oh. Listen, I didn't think it was going to be that big a deal. Haven't we all been on the open range? It's not that bad. Come on. Good grief. Oh, okay. 80. Man, I'm going to run out of strength because these stupid desperados die. No! I killed him! Oh, I got hurt. Man, it's a good thing I brought that backup whiskey. I'm not going to screw with this guy because I'm only one day out of town. Fight. 88. Bam. There we go. Come on. Please. I gotta be there. Yes. No! What? You said 10 days. Dead comment. I hope I get my strength back when I'm there. Yes, I agree. Yes! Oh, that ain't good. Uh... 
mean I went all that way for that? Now that is an absolute load of garbage right there. They just waited until I staggered and got beat the crap beat out of me all the way across the desert and the pink that's arrested when I get to town? Oh my god. Well, at least I'll... Look. At least in prison I'll get a square meal. <laughs> no one will be mad, angry, and annoyed at me. Oh, that's... That's great. I... <laughs> That is, that is entirely, uh, that is unwarranted right there. That is, ah, oh, jeez, I am speechless on that one. Oh, I, why didn't you say something, High Riser? All right, enough of this. That's gone. Eh, get that out of here. Gee, many Christmas. What a what a teasy game that is. Good God. All right. It's listen, it hosed me big time. Those old the most repeated attacks in the desert were out of line. All right. What's next on the docket here? Oh boy, my scroll has stopped. So we're at the What was that one everybody wanted to see? And if you had if please re ask if you had one. What was that called? Glue for something? Is that what that was called? Help me out here, somebody. That was called glue for... Glup. Oh, an old tower. Okay, we'll do both those. And if you if, if you ask for one that I'm forgetting, just I'm not being a jerk. Just My brain's tapioca. Plus, I've been in the desert for ten days. I mean, give me a break. So, Gluff is a game. Surely that's not on here. Glu I've got Glug. Gl I don't have Gluff. Sorry. That's the first one. Does that, stand Does that stand for anything? Let me see if the other... If I've got Old Tower. Sorry, Gluff fans. I want to get back to that one. Let me see if I get old tower. Man, that Western game. It's gonna be a while before I forget that. That was a I don't have old tower either. Uh man. That must be are these newer games? Terrapins? Oh, the first game you ever released, eh? Okay. Let me see if I got that. Ah, Terrapin. I got it. Okay, you thought me know if this is the if this is the one you had. Okay. That's not is that is that yours? Oh terrapins. Terrapins. I don't think I saw terrapins, but I'll look. But while we're here, I hate to waste it, so let's see what it is. Oh, it's turtles. It's Turtles Boat. We actually know about this game. Uh, from the, uh, was it the Odyssey 2 boat? We played this. I believe. Oh. Let's try this again here. Unless you gotta get your baby. Whoops. Man, this is harder than when I remember. Look at all this weirdness here, too. Strange. I don't know. A little bit. Oh, I see. There's a house up there. I didn't even notice that. There's a game called Turtles. It's an arcade game. Oh, okay. I didn't know I had one on my back. Yeah, this is a little bit different, but I like it. This is, I, I like what they've done here. You gotta get out of your house. And they move the house. Cute. Yeah, I hope I do. Here, let me go ahead and check real quick. Uh, there you go. You know what Terrapin is, anyway. 
Uh, yeah, I didn't see it. I do not have Terra pins. However, I will obtain it, and the next go around, we'll give it a whirl. What'd you say your other game was? Jet? Was it Jetman? Jetpack? D RX? Let's see if I got that on here. I like Jetpack. Let's see here. Nope, don't have that one either. Yeah. Hey, listen, I'd be more than happy to Patreon you up, my friend. And, and, and get those on the up and up. That'd be awesome. Well, since we have uh, exhausted those... I saw a few other requests here. I'm going to back up here. Um, and again, if you if you said one that I missed, please shout it out because it's hard for me to keep up with this stuff. That's nice of you, Alan. I appreciate that, man. Tyrex. Yes. He's been pitching that one for a while. By God, I'm going to try it. Oh, Aquaplane. Oh, I'm going to try all those. Those all sound great. Let's go with Rex. For our toxic luchador here. Let's see if I've got it. Rex. Oh, there's a Rex 2. Did you know that? Rex. 128. Doing that one. That's pretty cool. Alright, here we go. Use the co- uh oh Use your code. Uh. Uh, move. Move. Four, four. Uh oh. Uh. Eh. Looks like this one might have had copy protection on it. Anybody have a thought? Uh oh. Huh. I've got other versions on here. Shall we try one of those? Otherwise, I'm about to look that up. Because that looked at the opening screen looked cool. Okay, so let's try the tape version. Shoot, that was the 128 version. I'd like to have seen that. Oh, well, let's try the uh, tape. Ha ha! We talked about that in the show tonight, Tex. I buried it. I buried that deep beneath the crust of the earth, my friend. Uh, it looks like a graphical update to make the machine operate and look more like a Mac. If I wanted that, I'd just buy a Mac. Okay, we got the Kipston. Bam. Yes, I confirm it. Okay, let's say it's going to work, dude. Oh, dude. Hey, Riser. I love that game on the Amiga. I love that game. Oh, man. What is this? Oh, man, I died instantly. So am I jumping? Oh, okay. That's interesting. He's like he's got like hopping skills. And I like the I like the background. Looks like whoa! Holy smokes! Oh my god! <laughs> that looks. This is hard. Now, how are you supposed to get past that? It's a 0% chance of getting past that. What am I doing wrong here? Vingador. I'm assuming you've played this game quite a bit. Oh my god. Okay, stop. Yeah, it's well hard. You got that right, pal. Like right here. That was a miracle. A Christmas miracle. Now, what killed me there? Those explosions are awesome. How do you throw a bomb, dude? That might help. I didn't know about the bombs. Oh, he's got shields, dude. Which I'm exhausting. Double fire. Okay, let's turn off the shield. No, turn off. 
Turn on! Okay. Hey, listen. The shield makes this not a complete death maneuver. Okay, let's see if I can figure out these controls. So, holding the button and uh, holding down does the shield. Okay, pushing up jumps. I'm trying to figure out how to throw the bomb. Is it... Oh, I can go down here, y'all. Let's try that. You can't shoot those. Look at that. There's like a train down there. That's pretty cool. I need to learn how to throw these bombs. But you can't just ram into stuff with that shield. That's for sure. Yeah, this looks real good. I mean, this is another one, guys. It's not going to be... You're not just going to pick it up and go. Those explosions are nice. I like that. I bet the 128's got some cool music. That's a shame that we didn't get to look at that one. I may have to dig around. I bet, I'm sure I could find a 128 cracked version. It looks like your guy's like a rhino. Got a mosey down here again. I'm going to go the other way this time. Oh, shoot. I love that. That's that's really neat to look at. They give you a good amount of man, that's for sure. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Damn it. There you go. Hey. Vingador, I give that one a thumbs up. That's one we need to look into further. I like that. I like that one quite a bit. So, next on the docket, Aqua Plane. Mysterious Aqua Plane. Right, let's give that one a whirl. Anyone here ridden on one of those Aqua Planes? Looks pretty cool. You know, with the big things on the bottom. I'm sure there's a few Navy guys in here. Aquaplane. Aha! Got it. Aquaplane. Wait a minute. This seems familiar to me. Okay. Oh, no. No, we haven't played this. All right. Oh, yes! Oh, this is gonna be tricky. Yeah, I don't think I think I was boned right there. So, you, can you can the aqua plane go in the air? Yeah, I see that. What do you attribute that to? Man, how do you, that? That's tricky right there. No, no, no. I would remember this one. I was, I was wrong. I, we have not covered this one. The button doesn't seem to do anything on this. I was kind of hoping the button would make lift you up in the air or something. Like this right here is tricky. Like how are you gonna get through there without getting your guy killed? Some of this, are, some of this is tough. Okay, yeah. Hey, like my guy's waving. Yeah. Oh, sailboats. I'm sure boats are already in bed, but he'd love this. What's up, 48K? I didn't know you were even in here, my friend. Enjoying the tunes? Oh, okay, dude. Good tip. I'm well, glad to see you, dude. I was happy to probably catch some of your stream the other night. I enjoyed it, man. As always. I think I'm getting the hang of this. I think the sailboats are a lot easier than the in the logs. Did 
This one has, has been real simple. You're kidding sharks, eh? All right. Here we go. Oh, man. We must be in international waters. Uh-oh. Oh! Well, that's not bad. Not bad. Oh, I got my name in, so you know I'm great. Can I... Use, let's see here. Oh, what the hell am I doing? All right, there you go. <laughs> I was going to put my name in like an idiot. <laughs> I shouldn't even be proud of that. Hey, you can't go wrong with Star Raiders, dude. All right. What was the next one we had thrown up there? We had Aqua Plane Mind Shadow. That sounds awesome. It's a good name. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Let's see if we got the sucker. You guys have come up with some real oddballs tonight. I love I love uh I love doing this ZX because a lot of this the majority I haven't seen, so it's, it makes it a lot more fun. Mind Shadow. Let's go. Oh lord, what is this? <laughs> okay. Well, we've got one of these, do we? This is an Activision game, apparently. Let's see here. Get shell. Uh, look shell. Listen. Shell. Ah! <laughs> you have to be old to get that, but there you go. Lauren Green was the star behind Bonanza and the ever-popular Battlestar Galactica. Great, great, big star. Big, huge cowboy star. Yeah, Curtis gets it. So, uh, what else do we have here? Look. Let's see. Climb tree. Okay, let's see. North. Whoops. Guess a little. Oh, look at this. <laughs> I had to walk up to it. Oh, no. What a rip -off. Oh, we're not in it. <laughs> uh, let's see. That'd be what, east? I think that sign's a lie. I want to go quicksand. That's for suckers. Uh oh. Let's see here. It's walk the land. You're sitting feeling sick. Oh, no. Not quicksand. Huh. I guess the sign wasn't lying. <laughs> well, nuts. <laughs> Why didn't you guys tell me not to go that way? <laughs> Look, shell. You never know when you're going to need these. Let's go south this time. Okay, we can't. How about west? Well, how about east? You know what we're doing here, Ricky. Is that true? The island dead ends here. Well, okay, fair enough. So, you, who's raise your hand if you've played this game and are familiar with it, please? Because I'm stunned that at least either you guys are just talking out your butts. Or you actually have played this. Go hut. Look at this. Oh, look. Can't spell barrel. Uh, lay. Let's see here. 
What we got here? Oh, band of uh, search uh, straw. Okay, get straw. Okay. Look at you two. You guys remember this thing. That stuns me. <laughs> I love it, though. Look bad. Go hammock. Oh, pfft. what a jerk. Can I throw the stall on the straw in the quicksand? Would that help? Where's Hermski when you need him? Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Okay. Oh, look at that. Boat. Let's see here. Get metal. I like it. Are you just pulling this out of your brain, Ricky? How long has it been since you've loaded this up and played it? See you later, dude. Thanks for just dropping by. We appreciate that, man. Check out 48K's uh, stream uh, about the Atari. It's awesome. Check him out. He's always good. Let's see here. Ah, I did. That's exactly the way I went. Got to draw in all these trees. Yeah, I, I caught some of that, Curtis. It was real good. Okay. Get vines. All right. Yeah, I knew it. I'm ahead of you, Ricky. Uh-oh. Hey, thanks for popping in, Alan. Appreciate it. Yeah, that was fun, all right. Fun for you guys. I felt like a schmuck. <laughs> it says I can't go west, man. All right. South? Nope. Can I go west? No. East? Yes. Uh-oh. What is that? Is that a hole? Oh.
with Tavon. Oh. Look at that. I'm ahead of you, dude. I've got this down. There we go. All oh, right, I didn't get me. Oh, you're kidding me. Go cave. Okay. I wouldn't have guessed that one, I'd say. We're all dying to see what we dig up here. Oh! Get map. Oh, no. Is that is that uh hut the one we saw in the jungle? I'm assuming it is. I see. Very good. Well, I, th I would I would see if I can save this right here. I'll pick this up. I'll pick this up from here next time. See, I, I think I can save. Let me have a look here. I've been wanting to try this anyway. It's a good time to do it. So let's do this. Let's see here. I don't know if I've got a save setting or not. These old games you can't save anyway, can you? Ah, oh, dadgummit. Well, we'll come back to it. I want to make sure I catch the next one. This actually was more fun than I anticipated. I don't know what that means, but yes. I, I kind of enjoyed that. That takes me back, way back. To the old days. We got time for maybe one or two more here. I'm going to go back and see what I've got on the docket here. Do oh, you think that would work? I'll try it. What the heck? S-A-V-E. Ha! I doubt that'll work. Ha! Ha 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 ha. Bam! Nice one, Ricky! <laughs> If that looks back up, I'll be, I'll be very impressed. It worked, though. It said it worked. All right. So, this is the la this is the 11th hour. Uh, if I have not played your request, now is the time. I'm looking up here to see if there's anything I missed. Uh, we did Mind Shadow. We did Aqua Plane. We did Rex. We may have cleared the docket here. Yes, sir. I will definitely have some for the next go around. Uh, let's try one more random game. Oh, there you go. Thank you, footballer. I knew you had requested one. It was Underworld. That game rings a bell. It could be Sky Shark. Okay, the last two games tonight Underworld and Sky Shark. And we'll do Underworld first. Underworld. I know we've played this because I remember I remember playing it. Um, Tempston. Start game. Okay, let me uh, let me get it going here. All right. Man, look at the leaf on this guy. Oh, good God. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Okay, I, I don't remember this. So maybe I played a game that was the same name. Man, I'm getting you smacked around. Can you do anything to these guys? Or they just pummel you? Let's get out of here. Man, knocking you off screen. That's cold-blooded. Man, and they won't leave you alone. Anybody played this before? Can anybody give me some... some uh, 
give me any any pointers? This looks like my kind of game. Except for the perpetual hounding of these demon guys. Oh, no. Pick something up there. I don't know what it was. Oh, God. Part of this is familiar to me, but I don't know why. Find the exit? Okay. My God, it's hard to jump around this. Jumping from screen to screen is incossible. I mean, I am. I hope the exit is at the bottom of this crevasse. How do these guys keep finding me? And if you jump off screen, it just goes away. Oh, there's a diamond. I gotta have that. Don't hassle me. No. Dad gum it. And that okay, so I can't jump from there. I gotta jump. Here we go. I got it this time. No! I'm not too fond of that one. I'm not gonna lie to you. Not my favorite. Not my favorite on that one. I'm sure if I knew what I was doing, it'd be more fun. But it's too frantic for me. So, the last pull of the night uh, will be the Sky Shark. Sky Shark. Which I believe is based on an arcade game. I know I've played this on other systems. I don't know if I've played it on here. I know, man. 2%. I did better on your game. Let's see here. I see so much stuff I want to try. It's unbelievable. Believe it or not. I don't have it. I do not have Sky Shark. Good night, Explorer. Thanks for joining us, man. Oh, Flying Shark. I do. Uh, yeah. Have a good evening, my friend. You're, we're almost finished up anyway. You made it to the end, man. But by God, we're going to play this Flying Shark game if it kills us. Let's see here. Flying Shark. Huzzah! We got it. Let's go with this one. All right. Pretty good tune. Graft Gold. They make some quality stuff. Oh. <laughs> Go Graft Gold. They never screw us. <laughs> Let's play the other version. Clearly that one <laughs> didn't quite get off the runway in every in every facet of that meaning of that word. Let's try this version. All right, this time. Craft Gold never screws us. There we go. And that's why you always have to have a couple versions, right? All right, here we go. Now, this seems okay. I'll tell you what. The yellow on, on yellow palette, though, that's rough. I probably would have made this ship look like a different color. Or the tanks. I mean, there's no, I don't, can't imagine any reason why they couldn't use at least one more color. That's brutal. That's very tough to see. Double shot, though. Otherwise, this controls real well. It 
sounds horrible, of course, but it's the sound one would have expected. Okay, you hold the... I was wondering how you do the bomb. If you hold the button down, you get the bomb. Triple shot. Hey, we're making some headway here. Making some headway. Oh, man. I'm doing better at this than I did our type, I can tell you that. Man, if they could have done something about the pallet on this, this is not bad. A lot of enemies on the screen, it runs smooth, it runs at an easy clip. You know, graphics look pretty nice. They're pretty good looking little graphics. I mean, it's your patented, let's take up most of the screen with the, you know, borders. I'm guessing this has two player simultaneous play. That's nice, you know, because you can tell by the way it's set up. So two players of this at once would probably be a lot of fun. Ah, oh, dead gummit. Oh, I wasted that. Man, it took me all the way back to just one shot. I'm in deep trouble now. That triple shot was doing a lot of damage. Those bullets are tough to dodge. Look at that. I can even see it. Dead gummit. Oh, well, there you go. Well, I think we're going to take it to the house, uh, my friends. Uh, boy, uh, thanks, for, uh, thanks for coming out tonight and uh, checking us out. Uh, we appreciate it, and by we, I mean me. I don't know why I'm speaking like this. Oh, there's a guy in the back. i talk for him, too. Uh, had a great time. Thanks again for Alan for uh, letting us play his new Asteroids game. Uh, if you feel so inclined, uh, please support the man. A good game. You know, it looks good. Uh, and uh, thanks for everyone sticking around. We had a, a real good crowd tonight, man. Hey, and thanks to all the people that tuned in early to check out the suspense. I'll be back with another one next week. Hey, listen, I don't know what I'm going to stream next week. So if you've got any, uh, if you got any thoughts on the subject, uh, that's a Cthulhu. That's a Cthulhu doll, Ricky. Almighty, all powerful Cthulhu, buddy. Uh, yeah, Curtis, Curtis, <laughs> Curtis is on the payroll. I'm glad you mentioned that. Tomorrow night, uh, at seven o'clock, it will be happening as the Taze Valley. Classic Computer Club meets for the first time in several years uh, in the Boat's basement. Uh, it'll be a cast of thousands, myself, Boat, all the usual suspects, my brother, the Brent, and his wife. Uh, the Chud will be there, good Matt. A lot of people you see on Team Speaker regulars will be in person, in the house, messing with computers and playing games. So uh, please join us. And, of course, me and Brent will be back Sunday, 10 a.m. for ARG Presents. This, this week we're doing... Games with one-word titles. One-word titles. And I can tell you, I'm playing Zorro. Zorro. So you know it's going to be gold. I'm going to delve into the history of Zorro, too. Anywho, I could go on and on. Thanks, everybody, for popping out. Appreciate you guys very much. And uh, we'll catch you guys again next week for another round of Amigo Aaron's Friday Night Disaster Stream. You guys have a nice evening. Until next time, adios.